Okay, so in this video, we're going to look about how to set out our, our Sense hat on the Raspberry Pi, how to have that set up. And there's two steps we need to do in relation to that, especially because of the setup we're going to be using where we're going to be remote desktoping into our Raspberry Pi. So the first off, we need to install the actual software package for the Sense hat itself. So again, open terminal and in here, we need to say um, sudo for super user, do, um, app get so application get let me say install sense hat and that will take the package and install it now again mine has already been installed because i have the latest version of raspberry pi os you may not and so in which case you actually have to um you will have to actually upgrade it or install it that way now the next thing you need to do is a little bit tricky because with our configuration we are going to be remote desktop accessing our Raspberry Pis um, with the Sense hat. So to do that, we've discovered that you actually, there's a problem that if we try to do the terminal, try to do the remote access with the Pi hat, um, with the, the Sense hat, it doesn't actually, won't boot correctly if there's no monitor actually connected into it. So we need to change that. So to do that, we need to go into the configuration. So to do that, go sudo um, raspberry, um, dot config and that brings this screen up here and here's the steps that we have to follow through so first off we have to go down and using our arrow keys until we find the uh, advanced options and advanced options enter and in advanced options we're going to choose resolution and then the res resolution we have to set it to is DMT mode 82, 19, 20 by 10, 80, 60 hertz, 16, um, 9. Now, obviously, mine was already set up the other way. Otherwise, I couldn't be remote desktoping into this to record this video. But yours may be up here at the default. So you need to scroll down until you get to this mode 82 and make sure you have that. And once you've done, press right until you go OK. Um, resolution is set to that. OK again. And then we go right, that's using the right arrow key till we say finish. And now it's finished. And so your Pi is now ready with the Sense Hat software on there, as well as um, set up so you can actually remote um, access into your Pi with the Sense Hat actually being there as well. 